Our first alert forecast this morning and yeah, dry, less humid. OK, I'm liking where this is going for our week, Jamal. I don't think we're looking too bad. Yeah, I don't think so. Plus, we got a nice breeze outside. So let's see if that's going to continue throughout the day. Meteorologist Chandler Jordan joining us for a look at your first alert forecast. Chandler. Hey, yeah, outside. yeah, you know, this morning feels great outside. You know, we've got the breeze to work with. We're getting this cooler air in this drier air in and it's thanks of our cold front that we had make its way through the Midlands last night. If you remember, some of us got some rain and thunder out there yesterday. It's thanks to this boundary as it was passing through. So with it to the south, we're going to keep these showers and thunderstorms away from us and from our north and northeast. We're going to continue to filter in this drier and cooler air. You can see out there this morning that here in the Midlands we're dry. No need to track any type of rain to get the day started. Just a few fair weather clouds at times for us. You can see those off in the distance of our Segra Park camera and it's shaking because of the wind dust that we've already picked up out there at times this morning. It always takes a little bit of additional time for the cooler side of things to catch up once you have a frontal passage. That's why for many of us this morning we still have temperatures in the low 70s. These clouds certainly aren't helping things as far as us being able to cool off. But by this afternoon, some gorgeous weather ahead. As a reminder, the Fireflies are playing a double header today. They're making up a game from July. That'll start at 5 o'clock. Nurses night first pitch starts at 7 o'clock. Both are looking gorgeous. Temperatures will start to cool off by around 7 into the upper 70s once we get past sunset low 70s out there by 9 o'clock and as we head into the night tonight we have a very good chance for all of us to wake up with widespread 60s across the region and with the passage of our cold front to our south it's dropped our moisture content in our area Tuesday and Wednesday dew points are only around 60 degrees Thursday and Friday we're going to start to have our dew points begin to climb once again that's as a little more moisture builds in but we're still not going to be talking about the sticky and muggy type of air that we've had with our summer like temperatures. Here's first alert future cast out there for you this morning. You can see that we're breezy at times with a few fair weather clouds and that's what we have all throughout the day. Wind gusts anywhere from 15 to 25 miles per hour and that'll be with a few fair weather clouds and a high temperature that climbs into the low and mid 80s. All in all perfect day for us out there. Things change a little bit Tuesday night into Wednesday. We're still going to be a little breezy. We'll get a few additional clouds to build in out there. Wednesday morning is cooler. Thankfully temperatures in the mid 60s with the breeze. It'll feel awesome outside. And then as we get into your Wednesday afternoon, notice how we get cloud cover to continue to slowly increase once again. Still a little breezy at times Wednesday with a daytime high around 80 degrees. And then as we get into your Wednesday night, cloud cover really starts to thicken up and that's thanks to our next disturbance approaching us from our west Thursday. The 20% chance stays in maybe a shower or two out there in the afternoon better chances of rain for us starting on Friday. We'll get some rounds of rain as well as a little bit of thunder for you for the end of the work week, even into the start of the weekend. Low 80s for us for the highs in the afternoon. Couple of showers can't be ruled out to get the day started, but by the end of the weekend, we're drying out. Looking pretty good as well for the back half of your first alert 10 day forecast and with highs only in the low and mid 80s. Make sure you stay right there. Sunrise is back after the break.